Hey guys, I'm Nisha Homi. Today I'm sharing two healthy ice cream recipes made with easily available ingredients. The ice creams are made without dairy milk, whipping cream, eggs, condensed milk, sugar or corn flour. Super healthy ice creams which you can include in your weight loss diet. So let's get started with the recipes. To make the mango kulfi, I'm using just two ingredients that is mangoes and my vegan curd. So this is one and a half cups or 350 ml of thick home set vegan curd. I have already shared four different vegan curd recipes. Please do check it out. Naturally fermented curd or yogurt is a good source of vitamin B12 and it is also a good source of healthy gut friendly probiotics. I made this curd using cashew nuts and you can see how thick and creamy the curd is. I've already shared a detailed recipe on how to make a vegan curd at home. Please do check it out. For those who don't have any issues with dairy milk, you can use dairy milk curd instead. This mango is around 1 kg. And now I'm going to peel the mangoes and roughly chop the mangoes. So I'm using a sharp knife and peeling off the skin. This is how I prefer to do. It's much easier for me to peel the mango like this. Okay, now the mango is peeled. So I'm going to chop the mango. Now to chop the mango, just slice the mango like this and roughly chop the mangoes into cubes. Now when you're choosing mango to make this recipe, make sure the mangoes are sweet enough. Once peeled, simply slice and chop the mangoes roughly. Into my blender jar, I'm adding in the thick home set vegan curd. Into this, I'm adding in the roughly chopped mangoes. And now I'm going to blend this until everything is nicely mixed and combined. And uh, note that I'm not using any extra water. Another important thing which you should uh, take care is not to use mangoes which are high in fiber. So try to source mangoes which has less fiber to make this recipe. Okay, now it's nicely blended. You can see how thick and creamy it is. So this is the reason why I mentioned to use fiberless mangoes. If you use mangoes with fiber, then you will not get it soft and smooth and silky like this. So try to source fiberless mangoes when you're making this recipe. I'm using small paper cups like this instead of kulfi mold. You can use a kulfi mold or a popsicle mold instead. Into the paper cup, I'm adding in the blended mango puree. You can sprinkle some chopped nuts uh, like uh, pistachios on top if you prefer for some added color. But today I'm keeping it simple, just two ingredients, mango and vegan curd. Once all the cups are filled, I'm covering it. Make a small slit in the center with a knife. Place an ice cream stick, slit in the center and then insert an ice cream stick. And now I'm going to keep it in the freezer overnight or for about 6 to 7 hours. Okay, now the kulfis are ready to serve. Just before serving, immerse it into a cup or a glass with water. You may need to immerse it in water for about 10 to 15 seconds or until you can easily remove the kulfi from the mold. So basically you're doing a water bath. Okay, now the kulfi is easily removed from the mold. So like this, I'm going to remove the rest of the kulfi. And my super healthy mango kulfi is ready to serve. Today I'm sharing a three ingredient mango ice cream 
without condensed milk sugar milk cream eggs or even corn flour super easy healthy and creamy See in this recipe i am using two mangoes which weighs around 1.25 kilograms the name of the variety of the mango i am using is imam pasand it is very juicy and very sweet you can use any variety of mangoes you get locally however if you can get alfonso mango you will get a more vibrant color imam pasand variety is very huge but it is very sweet and has a distinct flavor first let's make cashew milk and for that i'm using 20 cashew nuts which i have soaked for about 10 minutes now instead of cashew nuts you can use soaked and peeled almonds or if you have cashew milk or almond milk or any plant based milk of your choice at hand you can use that instead in this recipe i'm counting the plant milk that is the cashew milk as one ingredient now into my blender i'm adding in the soaked cashew nuts and half cup of water so when you blend the cashew nuts and water you get homemade fresh cashew milk the next ingredient is dates for some natural sweetness i'm using six soft medjool dates increase or decrease dates to suit your taste if the dates you are using are not soft soak them a little before adding it into the blender now blend this all really well for about 30 to 40 seconds and then open the lid mix with a spatula and again blend for about 30 to 40 seconds next add in the third and the last ingredient which are the mangoes for easy blending i have roughly chopped the mangoes now add the mangoes into the blender and blend all this really well and once the mangoes are blended well and is smooth pour it into a tray and level the top with a spatula sprinkle some chopped cashew nuts on top cover and let it freeze for about 7 to 8 hours or overnight and once the dairy free vegan mango ice cream is ready serve the ice cream and enjoy this healthy mango ice cream with family and friends So guys do try this three ingredient mango ice cream and thank you for watching and until next time take care bye bye